But let me switch gears to the NFL right here because players kneeling during the national anthem, the NAACP responding to the Dallas Cowboys owner Jerry Jones's comments about benching players that disrespect the flag. Here's the statement reading in part Jerry Jones's comments are more than tone deaf, more than misinformed and misguided. They are a public commitment by an NFL owner to violate his players' constitutional right to free speech. NFL Hall of Famer Joe Namath also weighed in on the protests during an interview on Fox and Friends yesterday. Here's what Namath said. We have a right. This is America, liberty, a lot of freedoms. Ownership has ownership. Again, if somebody starts walking through here carrying a sign, well, what are the do. powers that be at Fox going to say to you? Excuse me, go do that somewhere else. Don't do it in the workplace. That's the point. Judge Napolitano, what do you think about that? Can right, the NFL well, force players to stand for the next Okay, be, because this is a workplace issue. You know, the football field is the workplace for a, a given team. Partly paid for by taxpayers. Correct. It depends upon where the workplace is. Example, New Jersey, New York, the District of Columbia, and California have statutes which permit the expression of political opinion in the workplace in defiance of management as long as that expression doesn't impair the work product. So if management could show Jerry Jones or, or the families that own the Giants, if they, I'm just giving you two examples, mm. could show that by some players taking the knee, the team is losing revenue mm -hmm. or morale is impairing the, the playing of the sport. Mm -hmm. That would be a reason to compel conformity oh, so that has nothing to do with the content. The, the ratings are down. Really fine. Right. I, can they Judge, find a player for kneeling? Judge, I want to raise an issue Again, with you. Again, it depends on where they are. But I want to raise an issue with you that you brought up on this program is that it depends on the collective bargaining agreement. With well, what, the, what the league can force the players to do, it's based on whatever's in their contract. Except that state law would trump, trump the collective bargaining agreement, as would the following principle. The, the NFL cannot compel political or patriotic conformity on property owned by the government, which is almost all of the stadiums. Hmm. The dirt, the earth that they're standing on is owned by the government. Are Just as the government okay. can't compel speech or prohibit speech, the NFL can't unless the speech, and, we're, and we, when we say speech, we mean expressive mm -hmm. conduct, even a silent taking of the knee, to use this phrase, is considered speech right. in the constitutional parliament. Even, even uh, unless the NFL can show that by taking the knee, the work product, the game, the revenue is being impaired, mm -hmm. it can't interfere. Well, can but if it can show that the, right. that the work product is being interfered, then it mm -hmm. can interfere. We just showed it. Dagan just told us what the ratings have been doing. They're losing money. Well, the, the, if they can demonstrate that they're losing money, then they can, and the loss of money is because of the, ta the taking of the knee. They can prohibit the taking of the knee. They could show video of fans burning jerseys and tickets being lit up. I mean, the, the, well, if the tickets have already been paid for, then there's no money loss, Kevin. But just to clarify, just to clarify, I can understand. <laughs> I can understand that the NFL in these certain places cannot compel speech, but can they punish speech? Can they fine them or suspend them or, you know, keep them in the locker room? Only if their speech, taking the knee, interferes with the uh, owner's ability to earn money, not because the owners disagree with the speech. So, in other words, they have to punish the speech for a non-content aspect of the speech. Gotcha. All right, Judge. Great insight. Not easy as stuff. No, it's not. <laughs> you, you get it. Letter of the law to a T. Thank you so much. Oh, pleasure. Andrew pleasure. Napolitano there.